What's up, guys? 2018 Certified Football eBay, eBay Half Case Break Number 8. Let me ask you guys a question. So I've got, in my one league I'm with Scott, I've got, I'm 2-0 right now. And I think I'm projected to beat the guy I played this week, which obviously projections don't mean shit. I've got Le'Veon Bell on the bench. Do I try and find a trade for Le'Veon Bell? Or do I just hang on to him and ride it out? What do you guys think? Nothing yet, Jay Bird, but I was trying to figure out kind of what I could get for him, and I, I don't know. I th I'll look and see. I'll, I think I've got... Who are my running backs? Let's see. I've got Jordan Howard... Well, at the beginning of the year, these were my three running backs. Le'Veon Bell, Jordan Howard, and LaShawn McCoy. And I was feeling pretty damn confident about that. But, uh... Now, I'm trading McCoy for Mark Ingram, so I'm decently happy with that. And then I've got Buck Allen as my other running back. Um... I don't know. I don't know if I can trade Le'Veon Bell. I can't bring it into myself to bring to do it because I know the only thing I'll get for him would be probably front end RB two or a back end RB one at best. Um, I'm going to try and hopefully ride it out, to be honest with you. Hopefully they sign him soon. <laughs> yeah, Jaybird. And uh, and I had Juju and Marvin Jones as my other my wide receivers. So I was, hell yeah, I'm feeling pretty good. And then Mason Rudolph's my tight end. And Cam Newton's my quarterback. I'm like, hell yeah. I'm feeling pretty good about this team. Sure as shit. Bell's not playing. McCoy sucks this year. Howard's been somewhat disappointing. Even though everybody talked him up this year. Including myself. I thought he was going to have a great year. No dice. He is, but isn't he hurt this week, Jaybird? 
I don't even think he's playing this week. Um, yeah, that's that's definitely possible. He is out. So let me see who even has him. It's probably Scott. Sugar Shane. What the hell is that? And he's in last place, so maybe he would be interested. In a trade. Hmm. Uh, he might be. Let's. I'll think about it. I've got. I'm. I'm two and zero right now. Like I said, so I'm. I'm all right for the time being. I'm hoping I can literally just stay in the playoff hunt until Le'Veon Bell comes back. Malik Jefferson to nine ninety nine. Ronald Jones to 99. Maybe I'll uh, shoot him a trade offer. See what I can get. Terrence Cody. I'm somebody that I love trading, man. I think you get better through trades. Your draft, really, you can't have that great of a draft every year. Mitchell Trubisky to 499. I'll see if I can uh, maybe acquire someone like a Chris Thompson. Kind of a low-end running back. Number to 75, Ian Thomas. Probably He's probably a high-end RB2. What's up, BB? The only problem is, is if you get in a in a league where like number twenty five, Jair Alexander, like I was in a baseball league this year through my work. They literally did not want to trade at all. What's up, Shadow? What's up, Evan? They literally didn't want to trade at all. Like nobody would do trades. They would just decline them. Drove me nuts. Dilly dilly, can't go wrong with a nice cold Bud Light. I love trading, man. I think that's where you get good teams. You you can really tie law to nine ninety nine, especially like in my one league is with my buddies. So literally, like I trade all the time in that league because it's so it's easier if you know the people personally. I think Deron Payne to nine ninety nine. Jerome Baker to four ninety nine, to where literally like you can just text them and say, "Hey, dude, let's make a trade." Rather than if it's you're in somebody's league but you don't know anybody. Calvin Ridley, nobody wants to do any business. Some business. Jeremy Shockey. Work done to 99. Really, no trades whatsoever? That, uh, that doesn't really seem like a very fun league. 
Kyle Fuller to 99. You might as well just do the uh, draft lineups. The draft where you go in and you draft for the whole week. You know what I'm talking about? On draft.com or something. You get a one week fantasy lineups. Might as well do that. AJ McCarron to 499. Shadow, did you uh, end up winning anybody else yesterday? Mariota to 99. Shadow, how you doing, man? Dalvin Cook to 225. TV12. Just uh, going to the uh, Red Sox and Indians game tonight. Hopefully get us a home run ball. Jair Alexander to 9.99. So trying to hurry up and get these done. Royce Freeman to 5. Holy shit. Two cases in a row. Number to 5. Got a Jalen Samuels last case. Dang. So I had a question for you guys. I was talking to Scott, and he said if you make them buy, you can add the option to buy now. If somebody bids that you lose the buy now option, is this true? Demarcus Lawrence to 225. It is true? Damn. That's no bueno. Blake Martinez to 99. Kirk Cousins to 25. That's silly. Why does it do that? That's stupid. Um... I love fantasy football, and I, I do truly enjoy it, but I I guess I don't know how you could, I don't know how you could lose friends and family over something like, yeah, I mean, I'm sure you can, you'd win a lot of money, but it's not that serious or something. Joe Theismann to nine ninety nine. Jimmy Garoppolo to 99 Yeah, football. Um, every card ships. Um, the certified diamonds and gold teams. I just deem them as pretty much base cards. So, Duran Payne to ninety nine. We really we penny sleeve the numbered cards and top load the numbered to ninety nine or less, and everything gets shipped. So you'll get everything. Don't worry. Arden Auden Tate. To 225. Baker Mayfield. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm all about seriousness. And I love my fantasy sports. But I could never, like, lose a friendship or anything like that over it. I mean, it's not that serious to me. Duke Dawson to 225. I have not done a Dynasty League, Mark. I would love to, actually. Um, I just... I haven't really ever gotten the chance to. Um, I know I'm in a couple Keeper Leagues, but never a Dynasty League. I would love to get in one. I think it would be a blast. 
just kind of because I feel like it's a different strategy when you got to think long term. Uh, John BD Jizzle and just left actually. Yeah, he just left. They'll be back. They'll be back. They uh, he had to do some last minute shipping. Is just you in here, Molly? Oh God, Rory. That's what I thought it was. Uh, John, XR from this week is shipping today. So you should have it uh, Monday or Tuesday, I would think. Huh? I thought he was taking stuff. Okay, everything's shipping Monday, Shadow. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Everything is shipping Monday. No, not the ones from today. The ones from this week. Yeah. Back off, Robinson. Um, Shadow, the XR from that Scott broke earlier in the week will be shipped out today. I'm being informed. Falsely, but being informed. Yeah, yeah, Shadow, it'll be shipped out today. What's up, JS Plate? Drew Brees to 50. Shadow with Scott. I don't know if he's shipping out the XR base. Let me look real fast. Um, does not look like it. I think just uh, no base will be shipped out with Scott's orders, I don't think. Stefan Diggs to 199. Sorry, I mean, do you want the base cards? They're not really that cool. Rock Thomas to 499. Jair Alexander to $9.99. Uh, Shadow, actually, why don't you say something to Scott? Um, James Washington to $2.49. I'm sorry. Uh, say something to Scott. I don't know. Do you have his phone number or text him? Do you have his phone number, Shadow? Dermani Jones to four ninety nine. Um, I'll shoot him a text. Uh, we aren't that tight yet. I'll uh, I'll shoot him a text when I remind me. I'll text him right now. Actually, how's that sound? Um, All right, I shot him a text. We'll see if he texts back. Who knows if he's awake. Hey, what one was that? That one was seven. What's up, Brian and Pool Host? DJ Ool, DJ Ool. John Kelly to 25. What's up, Heath? How you doing, man? 
a little late to breaks this morning. It's 11.10. We started an hour ago. TB12. Jarek McKinnon to 99. Tony Gonzalez to nine ninety nine. Deshaun Watson to fifty. I did, Heath. I did pull some big monsters. Shaquem Griffin to nine ninety nine, and Josh Norman to four ninety nine. Had a couple to five already this morning. A one on one. Uh, DJ, we've got no basketball going on today. Um, do you know if there's any basketball tomorrow? Uh, looks like all football tomorrow. Heath, we got uh, what we got a James Washington to five, and a Royce Freeman to five. You ready for this? Yeah. Yeah, no problem, DJ. Um, but if you want basketball, I'm sure Scott's got some in the store. I know Heath and uh, yesterday we pulled a Mason Rudolph to five. And uh, Jerome Bettis and Le'Veon Bell, one on one. Pretty sick card, actually. Bradley Chubb. Austin Prohl to $9.99. Um, if you guys ever want to do breaks during the week, Scott's got a shitload of stuff at uh, nastybreaks.com. John Kelly to $4.99. So uh, feel free to hop on there and uh, buy into some spots. Say Jake sent you. Russell Wilson to $1.99. Kelvin Benjamin to faux 99. Dante Hightower. DJ Shark. There you go, DJ. Hop in, get yourself some uh, high end basketball stuff. I'm sure there's some nice cheap stuff on there. Colton Miller to four ninety nine. Rasheem Griffin to nine ninety nine. Traquan Smith to two forty nine. Ronald Darby. Curly Culp to four ninety nine. Leighton Vander Esch to twenty five. Like the fifth one to twenty five we pulled today already. Mm -hmm. 
Jordan Reed to four ninety nine. Rod Woodson to nine ninety nine. Curtis Martin to ten for the Pats. Nice card. That's my team for the Patriots. Whoever got it got a nice card. What do you mean, Jay Bird? Uh, the breaks that are breaking today are from eBay. Um, so the ones for next Saturday won't be put on cool so there's ones for sale for tomorrow that end probably eight o'clock or nine o'clock and then till probably 11 or 12 and then um, I think for this weekend they'll be put on it probably Tuesday Monday through Wednesday, I think. Sometime in there. Yeah, James. Um, the ones for Saturday and on Friday night. The ones for Friday night and on Thursday. And obviously for Sunday and on Saturday. But they will be put on through the week. Um, I think... Friday nights usually get put on on Monday or Tuesday. Keep the hits rolling. Quentin Nelson to nine ninety nine. Yeah, Jay Bird, hop on, man. I love talking fantasy sports. Love it. Carry on Johnson to one forty nine. If you came in, I would literally talk fantasy sports all day. I love it. Sean Alexander to four ninety nine. Derek Brooks. Plus, I mean Jay Bird. Um, you can get teams super cheap, and your upside is crazy high compared to like if you were to break with a store who can sometimes be outrageously expensive. John Kelly to seventy five. I mean, you can get teams for like. Anywhere from five, I mean, 99 cents to 10 bucks. And I think all it takes is one hit and you're good. You're covered. If, uh, if you wanted to buy in. Terrell Edmonds to 50. Marshall Falk to nine ninety nine. Ryan Erlacher to ninety nine. 
Luke Falk to 99. David Johnson to 499. Josh Rosen. Cameron Brait to ninety nine. Ain't gaming. Uh, we do not do that high end stuff. We are uh, we are for the poor. Uh, go to nastybreaks.com. I'm sure Scott's got some uh, opulence going. Let's see. Wish we could do break some of uh, that high end stuff, but uh, you guys would not spend that much money on it. So, but uh, go to Nasty Breaks. Scott's a great breaker, man. He's probably the best breaker I've ever seen. So, go on. He he does a lot of stuff. He's got st a boatload of stuff. Alshon Jeffrey to one forty nine. Leighton Vander Esch to four ninety-nine. MJ Stewart to nine ninety-nine. Darius Fountain to phone ninety-nine. Uh, if you guys do start upping the uh sales on some of these brakes we could probably start talking about some a little bit higher end stuff but Sean Alexander to 499 which James he uh, usually runs a filler so he's usually got some sort of uh, promo going on Derwin James to 75 that's a pretty sweet card Jesus. Ronald Darby. Leonard Fournette to ninety-nine. Yeah, James, I mean Scott I think Scott's a great dude, so he's he's a great breaker. Hopefully, I'm not uh, doing too bad. David Johnson to 499. How am I doing, James? Am I doing all right? Mitch Trubisky to 499. Look at you on top of shit. This is my fiance, Molly, if you don't know. Mm -hmm. well, there's only like 20 cards left, so. Yeah. Well, thanks, James. I uh, I try. Kiki Kute to Tree 99. Um, I uh, have a pretty good teacher to learn from, so. I'd say Scott's probably one of the best. Bruce Smith to nine ninety nine. Odell to fifty. If uh, if there's anything you guys want me to do differently, just say something. I'll I'll try. Can't show base cards though. Sorry, Shadow. Roll Tide. Get that crap out of here. Should be a good game though. Should be a good game, Vincent. 
Simi Cobbs to nine ninety nine. Leighton Vander Esch to four ninety nine. One thing I do hate about breaking on Sunday mornings is uh, I have to miss out on my weekly basketball. I used to play basketball on Sunday mornings. No more of that. Dalvin Cook to 225. Uh, Jay Bird, I would say YouTube um, Breakers is pretty shitty. I'll be honest with you. Dante Hightower. Um, I think it should be a great game, Vincent. One against 22. What time do they play? Is that a noon game? Uh, that was the break, guys. We're going to do... I believe Bowman High Tech is next. Yeah, Bowman High Tech. And then uh, we'll get crack lacking on that in just a sec. Thanks for stopping out, guys. Appreciate it.